Oh, the Gates Foundation is, uh, the, the Gates Project is actually, the formal title is Genomic Tools for Sweet Potato Improvement, is, uh, is a really large project. And I'd have to say that it's, it's, it's the result of our working with the foundation over a, a number of years to help sort of build the initial foundations for the project and then conceive what we need to do in the future to drive sweet potato improvement. Uh, the foundation, as you know, invests deeply in, in sub-Saharan Africa. Um, so this project is focused on in, improving uh, sweet potato for sub-Saharan Africa. Uh, sweet potatoes in Africa are what we call a, a staple crop. Uh, many people eat them uh, as part of their daily meal. The thing that's really cool about it, though, is that the new tools that we're developing for the project, they're going to benefit us right here at home, too. And we've assembled a a really stellar team of scientists here uh, at NC State. We have at least uh, four other scientists in addition to myself, one in plant pathology and three scientists in uh, the Bioinformatics Research Center uh, between CALS and the College of Science. And it's really bringing a really great smart group of people together here at NC State to tackle these problems. Our other partners are at the Boyce Thompson Institute at Cornell University, they'll be doing the genomic sequencing uh, for sweet potato. This will be our very first. Up until now, we don't have a sequenced genome for sweet potato, so this will be a first of the project. Uh, we have colleagues at Michigan State University. We have colleagues all the way out in Australia at the University of Queensland in Brisbane, Australia. And then we have our international partners through the, uh, the International Potato Center, CIP. And CIP has substations in Kenya, Uganda, and Ghana, and they have scientists in each one of these countries that we'll be working with in addition to their home office in, in Lima, Peru. And then we have two national programs, one of which is in Uganda that our chancellor, uh, Dr. Woodson, visited uh, back in 2013 around May. Uh, we were able to tell him about our program, so we learned a lot about that program back then. And uh, we have another uh, national program in Ghana that's, that's doing work and uh, our goal in short is to develop new uh, genomic and bioinformatic based breeding tools to help us improve sweet potato for the future. It's a big job and I've got to say that, 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 that um, one, I'm extremely, um, I'm humbled by the fact that the foundation would think enough about our programs here to invest so deeply in those programs. I'm also really excited uh, about the opportunity and uh, I'm also a bit concerned because it's a huge project to manage. Well, it is but I think we'll get it done. Absolutely. Yeah.